Hello everybody and welcome to another biology video. Today I'm going to be talking about spiders. Spiders are often featured in horror films and are uh, very rarely liked by people. In this program I'm going to show how spiders can be liked. Let's start with one of the most venomous spiders in the world. This spider is called the red back spider, which is a relative of the notorious black widow spider. These red back spiders are responsible for the most venomous bites in Australia, about 2,000 per year. Red back spider often use their venom to paralyze and kill their prey. They also use enzymes to liquefy the inside of their prey and then they suck up all the remains. The most disturbing fact is that red back spiders aren't afraid of cold weather and they can travel by ships to different countries like England, Japan and even Belgium. Another venomous spider we saw in Australia was huntsman. Some huntsman spiders like to roam around people's houses, just like this young one which I found hiding behind a flask in the kitchen of our cottage on my birthday party. Therefore, I also invited it to my birthday party. You know, that's what you do when you find a spider hiding behind a flask in your house on your birthday. You invite it to your birthday party. Fortunately, huntsman spiders aren't harmful to humans and eat pest insects like cockroaches, mosquitoes, flies, and some other annoying little pests that eat you <laughs> in the night, which I hate. That's why some people love them and keep them as a pet inside of their house. Spiders don't have ears and noses, but they can smell and feel vibrations with hair on their legs and body. Huntsman spiders can also use their eyesight to hunt. They have very good eyesight with eight eyes on two rows, with lenses in them similar to humans and unlike eyes of most insects. By the way, spiders aren't insects. Spiders have eight legs and two body parts, while insects have six legs and three body parts. Remember that. Spiders can produce silk and make webs. They use silk to catch and preserve their prey and build homes. This amazing orb weaver spider can make two types of webs. They use sticky silk to hunt, and they use non-sticky silk to make a home. I think my favorite spiders are orb, we are orb weavers. They're amazing, and I love huntsmen. I remember when one pounced at us. Uh, it was a little bit intense to see a spider standing up on his hind legs, ready to pounce on our faces. <laughs> but it was very beautiful, I liked it. Spiders can be amazing parents. They lay eggs in egg sacs, and wolf spiders even carry hundreds of children on their back every single day to raise them until they're big and they can leave and hunt by themselves. Your mother has to care for one, two, or three kids. This wolf spider needs to carry about a couple of hundred children on her back every single day. My question is, how does she not turn into pancake by the time she wakes up in the morning. As you probably already noticed, I love spiders. I even have a little house spider sitting in my room behind my bed, catching all the mosquitoes for me. And that's why I get about one mosquito bite per week. I know they might be creepy and crawly and people don't like that, or at least some people don't like that, but I love spiders. So I hope that next time you see a spider, you will like it and you won't be scared. Your mum can probably... Okay. Your mum can probably raise one, two, three, maximum four children. No, not well, maximum. <laughs> <laughs>